what do you need to do, speaking of which? Oh, probably everything. Oh, we're better off joining in, joining onto you then. But your map would be a lot more exciting than my map. Um, okay. We'll do that instead. Pat, you can join us. An agent is no longer in your group. Oh, I'll join him, you join me after that. Uh, if I remember how to do all this shit. Uh, where is he? There he is. That should have went through. There we go. Alright. Sorry about that. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are across the world. My name is Jesus Barman. I'm joined by Pac-Man. I'm joined by Doza213. Hello. And we're going to do some finishing off. Those has got plenty to do. Another agent has been promoted to group leader. Uh, Pac-Man should be joining us. I'll send him an invite if he hasn't come over already. Another agent has there joined us. Perfect. And uh, as you can see, as uh, as it is on screen, it is actually pissing down outside as well. Very thunderous where we are at the moment. Bit of a lightning, too. yeah, bit of that too. Bit of lightning. So enjoy. There's a few missions to do we've got to do. Golden Bullet is on, I do believe, I hope. Right. He's doing the crib walk for some reason, I don't know why. What are you well, doing? Tidal Basin. Tidal okay. Basin's up. That's one of my manhunt things I have to do. Okay, well, can we start there? Or do you have to hit the manhunt thing first, the bounty first? Bounty first. Go into from your map and go to bounties and. Oh, okay, the we'll do there? this one first then. Okay. Yeah, we'll do this one here, yeah. That's, a, that's, that's the one for Tidal Basin. That's the one for Tidal yeah. Basin. On that's the one. He's at Tidal Basin. That's the ticket. That's the ticket. Can we fast travel? Yes, we can. To the orange one, not the white one. Alright. Oh, this is going to be fun. But you haven't done this. No, this is the one we were going to do a few weeks back. Last time, that's right. Okay, so this and is the like end. And it was like 12.30 at night and we thought, nah, nah, let's be sensible. Yeah. And you know what? I think that was the right call too. Oh. That man is going to love this. Alright. You lead the way, son. Be careful, agent. You could be anywhere. Oh, golden bullet. There's golden bullet. That's going to help dramatically. Actually, you're probably lucky you're doing this on Golden Bullet, really, to be quite honest with you. You reckon? Yeah, definitely. Hard as balls before. Let me get some armor back. Drones, right? The bloody turret's useless. Not in this weather. Not in this weather. Hope you're enjoying your weekend. This is a Sunday night. 
bit of fun, a bit of relax. Did we miss somebody or? Who gives a shit? We're out. I need to swap up for a second. Something a bit more useful. Not through the wall. I'm coming, Pac Man. I'd rather be shooting at something. Get around that shoot! Fight that shoot! Take them all. You never know. Yep. You never, never know. The moment you don't pick it up is the moment you need it. Well, that's usually the way. Let me get some of these, get one of them. Just in case. Look at Packy, you're running like a champion. Now the sun's out, I can use long range. I need my long range. Today, sunshine. Oh, 
Ow! Dog up top. I got ya. Thank you. Ah, fuck wrong way. I'm not packing any other response. I know what he's up to. Good shot that one. Good. Yeah. Good job. Lovely. Give me some bullets. I gotta get him.
Yeah, I don't know. This one's gonna hurt. Oh. Huh? Oh, nice clip. Meet me at the castle. Very nice, very nice. Now, if I'm not mistaken, yes. you've got to go listen to that bloody thing and you're gonna get your next objective. Okay. So while you're doing that, I am... I can't remember what the next mission is after that. Gotta run some streets. Uh, I'll go to airspace for the time being and just run out the front. You need to go back to the campus and run in and oh, yeah. the whatever it is, the, the settlement, whatever it is. I'm going there now. You have to listen to the whole goddamn lot. It is barring his balls. But we'll get you the next mission. Thank you for joining us. This is always this Sunday afternoon. My name is Susan Muhammad. I hope you've enjoyed the episode that we put on a bit earlier. Uh, FKU Season 2, Episode 5. Clips and highlights. Two hours of fun and madness and stupidity. Just us. Having a bit of fun. Changing up the game for a little bit. And uh, just enjoying the shit out of it while we can. So, Joe's is just uh, off listening to a recording at the moment. He should have Boring. so far after that, I think, is the next mission. Which is going to be a good one. That was thanks Pac-Man for joining us as well. Let's catch up with Pac-Man. And uh, if you're not aware of this too, uh, after Thursday night with the boys, uh, was and blind men, uh, they'll be coming back Friday night. We're gonna have Friday night fight night returns. We'll be doing Wreckfest this week. So you can join us. That'll be at 7 pm Friday night for Friday night fight night. For a little bit of may mayhem, carnage, the stuff I love, stuff I miss. Come on, Packy, we'll just go find some stuff while he's listening to that. I'll listen to it now. Okay, have you got some on screen instructions? I'm looking for my. No, that's it. Nothing else. Do I have to go to another bounty? No, I'm looking for it now. Ooh, right. oh, yeah. Beatrice Anti Kaplan is on Roosevelt Island. There we are. Oh, I'm on Roosevelt. Yeah, that sounds like one. And away, away we go. Watch out, we'll clean up these barbies and you're all in there. Roosevelt, what is, Packy?
Well, let's go. Alright, we're in. This is Auntie and Beatrice Auntie Kaplan. Be careful, Agent. Auntie may be a former true son, but she is ruthless and unhinged. Uh, Packy, I got your ass covered. Take as many power pellets as you need. We'll get them ghosts. I mean, it's not burning, that's bullshit. It's gonna be burning, it's no way it's not. God. What a wanker. I know. Oh, take that. Make that. Always handy. So many missions on Rise Belt. Not bad, not bad. Yeehaw. Didn't let me know bloody meat kits, but the beast, the beast, it's <laughs> a little bit of first aid. Pretty going down a long way. Rogue striker drone detected. Oh, damn it. Hostile striker drone detected.
No more you can't get that run as fast as you don't get no. <laughs> Must have been. I can hear a lot of poofing, and that was about it, mate. No, no explosion. On the other side, huh? Oh, I can damage him. Okay, so we can hit him. Hold on, that's on. Yeah, exactly. He's exactly what I was thinking. Uh, maybe a fire one. So he puts your hand out through a wall, you can see his gun, you can shoot him. That'll work. I'll do it. Mm, Packing knows all the tricks. Been there before. Season. Hi, buddy. Bye, buddy. There we go. There we go. I got it, I got it, I got it. 
I think. Get some bullets, and I ain't gonna know them. There you go. Certainly. Certainly. That's bad. I'm gonna go with one soul. Text the way, uh huh, uh huh, I like it. Oh, okay, here we go. This is a shit part. <laughs> so much the way back here. Status deceased. Thank you. Oh, uh, now you gotta go to the computer agent. again. Agent, get to the hey, yep. You need to hear this. Okay. <clears throat> Let me pick up some shit. You did that. I'm gonna get rid of some shit. What was the time you wanted me to say? I was trying, man. <laughs> uh, back to the castle. Back to the castle? I'm gonna go back to the castle. Oh, well, you gotta beat the castle. I'm gonna go beat the base. I'm gonna take up my inventory. Oh, yeah. I come from India and uh, When we went through and I come down. Uh, I bought and I see us like Panda. <laughs> you better run each meal like shit. Come on. <laughs> there you go. She can have that. <laughs> I'm sorry, Pat Man. <laughs> His name is Stray Man. He comes and joins me some nights on games. <laughs> I'm good. He's a little character I developed. 
Yeah, it comes out on some streams. We have a good time. <laughs> it's a good hurt. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad. And for those of you who are interested, you can find him on YouTube. He does have his own little set on my um, YouTube streams. You hit the about tab below and find the big YouTube icon. I'll take you straight there. In the playlist, it's called Straya Man Videos. S T R A Y A M A N Videos. V W E D E O S. Has his own. He's got ghost hunts. He's got um, a lot of stuff. So if your ribs hurt already, Pac Man, I'd <laughs> suggest you go check that out a bit later. Actually, even in the episode we did earlier, that's um, on Twitch and previous to this, we'll feature it. It's on Australia, man. I don't know, it's two hours of clips and highlights of stuff we do, so feel free to check that out. Let's go to Coney Island. Coney Island? Oh, you know what to do? That's going to be a fight too. Up in your deep end, sir. Oh. Why does it take quick trouble? I'm just going to grab a quick drink. Excuse me for a second. Sorry, this is my thing. Sorry, I've got to do this straight. I'm uh, straight, man, buddy. Got to do this, Pac Man. That's my thing. Okay, we can go now. I'm happy. <laughs> Sorry. It's a little thing, but I like to do it. Small things in me, small minds. I know. And our mission so pipe, yep. Stole Get ready for some shit. If we can bring him in, and this is why I say you're like he got his bullets on. Last part of this is fucking horrendous. Okay, agent. I've got eyes on stovepipe. Looks oh, like right. he's repairing one of the launchers on the beach. Follow the yellow dots, buddy. not wearing any protective gear. There's only two launchers and I don't see any other hostiles. Where are the dirty bombs? This doesn't make any sense. You don't send one guy to take Manhattan. All I can say is get ready for a shit fight. Pac knows exactly well, I like what a good shit fight. Oh, uh, it's a shit fight. The road's clear. You're free to head west past the roller coaster. You're in range. Ah, Shooting. best streamer in the world. Love you heaps. Oh, thank you very much. That's very much appreciated. Thank you very much. Hope you're enjoying the program. As you can notice, Dozer, it's a little quiet. A little too quiet. <laughs> it's a little rash. Cindy said you'd be out of mortar range. It's too bad. That's the one. But you've encountered no opposition, and Stovepipe hasn't moved since you got there. You're clear to approach the hostile. Now you haven't done this, so I'm not going to spoil too much of it. But I'm just going to tell you: just get ready for a shit fight. It's about to start. Too far. I'm 
I'll be able to be here, sorry. There we go. Identification confirmed. All right. Zachary. Trin Enkos, thank you very much. Very, very much appreciated. What the fuck? Love the appreciation. As funny as it sounds, we don't hear it very often, and it's um, it's very nice to hear. Detected. Agent, drone incoming. Get to cover. Strike drone detected. Hostile strike drone detected. Alright, you're gonna have dogs coming on one side and you're gonna have helicopters on the other. Which one's worse? I don't know. Not dogs, bloody drones. Which is even worse. Thank you. Stop moving your bloody thing. Tell Dozer that he's carrying hard. I will. There you go. I'm sure he heard that. <laughs> that was from True Nan Cuz. Okay. Oh. Oh fuck. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, really. That order is back online. You got incoming. Alright, that's out. You should be fine. I got you. 
I don't know. Are you doing the dance? Look at you dance. I'll be back on a dip now where I turn it in. Thanks for jumping in. Rogue striker drone detected. Hostile striker drone detected. Oh shit, there you go. System curtailed. System reactivated. System disrupted. Yeah, There's some health where the tower is. Make sure you get some of that, you're gonna need that. Make them bullets. Oh, for sure. System reactivated. That's what I call this sucks too. Okay, now this thing, there's a little... You gotta have an eye all over the place. Yeah, you gotta, there's some wires that you gotta go to to find a... This power source is pretty much, you gotta turn off on either side. But there's gonna be a lot of shit around in the meantime. You have to take out those turrets. Can't approach well, they provide so much help. That was all right. Deactivated. Help over 
you if you need it. Wheatley in the back there. That's a <laughs> full frontal joke for anyone that's uh, right fighting there. Okay, this is going to get like shit. I don't know how Pac Man plays this, but it's just going to be a whole fight. I want to try to get into that bloody that little garage at the back there. It seems to be about the best cover. Um, yeah. It's not nice. Just run. Thanks, Pac. You guys got bloody superior water than what I do. That's like Bill's and what I do. Mine's good, but yours is fantastic. Come down the back here if you can. Okay, so you're going to go on a little bit of a journey. Uh. Okay, so you're going to have a little bit of a mission by yourself. It's going to feel somewhat familiar. 
uh, that all, all I can do, say is just do it in stages. You can use uh, weaponry, you might you want to use skills. But it's the end of the chapter. Okay. So you go enjoy. I'll still be on. I'll wait see I'll put you into private chat so we can talk still. Yeah. Alright, so while you're doing that. I'm pretty sure you go to another mission now. Yep, hit the part and away you go. He's gonna go sometime, Pac Man. There he goes. An agent has left your room. <laughs> Alright. Let's go uh, back to ZC. Up in your deep head, sir. I'll oh, we'll grab him and put him in chat so we can hear him. Uh, uh, oh, shit. Not that one. I can get a He's doing that, we can just run through a mission just for the hell of it. Let's see, I've done all these today, so what's a nice mission to run? Uh, viewpoint, no, airspace, no, space admin, no, Jefferson, we'll take Jefferson. <coughs> so, this is just a lazy Sunday. You're gonna go now? Okay, see you later, Pac Man. Thank you very much for joining us. Have a good one, bro. You do have to have an eye all over the place, mate. It's uh, ridiculous. I think I might just run straight through a little bit. You there, Bob? Oh no, maybe you didn't get it. I don't think I can send him another one. He'll just have to do that by himself. <laughs> So for those that plan at home, though, that was Auntie Mission, that was the end of Chapter 11. Uh, Stovepipe Missions, you don't see the ending because I've already done it on my character. He hasn't done it on his particular character. It's the first time for him to go through. Roosevelt, you kidding me? I'm not doing that. I just did Roosevelt Island, damn it. So I'm just going sit, to sit back. Uh, oh shit, make sure i got the right build on for starters. Because uh, that would be handy. Otherwise, that uh, could be problematic. And just uh, wait until he jumps back in. Hope you've all had a good time today. It's a uh, long weekend for us, so uh, we're just, uh, just taking, a, taking a chill pill at the moment. It's raining as you can hear. I don't know if you can hear that in the background. It's a little bit hazy. It's uh, definitely raining. It's storming this afternoon. Lovely for gaming, as uh, one would say. Absolutely smashing. But uh, we've had a nice week. Uh, we've had a we've had a new chapter start. We've had uh, the end of Filthy Friday. Shit. Um, when we've got the whole group, group back together. Had one last hurrah. Uh, a lot of things are changing down here at the moment, so we're changing with it, we're adapting. Uh, we love the time we had, so we don't know, but that was the, um, that was the reason, that was the occasion. And we had a fun night, as we always do. Uh, the schedule changes up a little bit this week. So, Monday night, uh, Lollipop will be hosting. That's Lollipop 134 if you're looking for her on Twitch. I think she will do normally Destiny probably on a Monday. Hopefully she's feeling well. Um, you'll find myself in the Black Hawks on Tuesday at 5pm. We jump on a little bit earlier for the boys in the East Coast. So uh, 
I can get to bed. <laughs> and to work on time. That's that's generally the gist of it. Uh, we'll go start Wednesdays, we'll be seven PM with uh Puzzle and Chuck Bay. As a ghost hunt, <coughs> we'll pick one of the ghost hunt games and uh play them or maybe two, depending on what it is. Depending on what we feel like. Uh, Thursday you'll find Division 2, 5 pm. We fly man and wads. The toothless crew as they're aptly named. That will say the co-founders. <laughs> the originals definitely. 100% most definitely. And uh, next Friday night is Friday night fight night. We'll be featuring Wreckfest. We're going to go out for a demolition derby. Haven't been out for one for a while, actually. Should be a lot of fun. I can see he's probably going to have trouble with this. <laughs> Suck ways away. But I hope you're having a good weekend. But we love the challenge. It's been quite a bit of fun. It's a, it's a new chapter, a little bit of a new phase. Uh, you might see some old faces, you might hear some, <laughs> hear some old tales. Uh, we're going to start doing small lands very shortly on Saturdays, if you would like to start the journey with us. That's coming up in a couple of weeks. Uh, we might revisit Ghost Recon Breakpoint as well. We tried revisiting Ghost Recon to uh, Wildlands. Unfortunately, on PC and the PlayStation, it's not been very friendly, is the aptly term to describe that. So, we've uh, put aside the game. Unfortunately, it's, it's one of those great games that you just want to play and you can't. That's, that's as simple as that is. You, you just can't. You can play it solo, piece of it, but you can't play it the way you want to play it, you know? And the way you want to play it is the way you should be playing you know, with the team going in, falls and all. It's having a lot. About time you guys bloody showed up. God damn it. Like a little bit of safe spot. Yeah. How are you still up? That turret gun saved my eyes. Yeehaw!
Jay, easy bruh. Just running through them like water. Hostile has flung golden bullet. Get out your face. Oh, no more. Um, aim them for a heroic. This one don't give you really good shit. Incoming hostiles detected. Oh, God damn it. Um. Hey there. Stick him up, I should have said. That would have been funny. Oh, day one. Oh, very nice. Look at me. You tripped. Down the middle. Oh, that balls. Every time, no protection in the balls. Gotta wear protection, boys, look at this. Go down. Well, I aim for the head, but I'm gonna hit you in the other head. Go down, just as quick. Damn, my son doesn't fire real quick. What happens when you get old? That's a pretty accurate shooting by me. I'm pretty impressed actually, I must say. Exactly. Rogue agents detected. Yeah. Aww. Where's the fun in that? I did see him in his right before. I don't know what happened to him. He's going to be in the middle of shit at the moment, so he's going to have to work that out. It's what happens at the end there. So you get one of those big fuck off machines, and I can't think of the name of them at the moment. Um, the one that's, you know, you've got to hit it bloody five different places. I'll think of it later. Um, while well you've got drones coming out and the enemy coming out. If you do it subjectively, like, you do one little bit, you take out the enemy, you do this, you do that. You can get through it. It's not hard. I did it with skills. There's a lot of the guys did it with firearms, which seemed to be probably easier for them. It's not hard, but it's, it wasn't easy on skills. Um, there's a little sequence that happens to prepare you for the next chapter. Which I believe is coming up on the 8th or so, as I've heard, which is four days. So, um, look forward to it. Um, that's normally my division day, so uh, if I happen to be uploading, I might have to do a later stream. Um, but, hopefully that'll come this week. I look forward to that. It's always fun when you get new content. Uh, new content, uh, hopefully uh, new everything. I've got a lot of shit apparently. Oh, I've got 20 of You wouldn't believe the shit you collect. So excuse me while I just blitz through these for two seconds. Well, that's not bad. I don't see anything that's not full just the golden bullet. gets out pretty much. Anything I'm not using gets thrown. That shit. I'm using that one. Interesting. Oh, it's a purple ship. Should have got rid of that. I don't use a lot of Firefly. Drone attachments I do, but I've got pretty much all, everything I need. Uh, shield attachments are all full, so I really can't. They all the same. Deflector, damage. 
They're good ones to have. Uh, what else we got? I've got to go through all these individually and delete them. That sucks. Um, what else can we delete? I'm going to put all this shit away. There's probably a lot I could donate, but yeah. My levels could be up way higher, but that's too much grinding for me. It's pretty much what it comes down to. Oh, hello. Thank you very much. Thumbs up. Back at you. Ooh, you're welcome. Anytime. Uh, so this is on PS5 for anyone that's um, <laughs> wondering. I'll give you a rundown of the builds while I'm going. Trying to make things just a little bit easier so you understand what we're running. Uh, the difference in my build and different difference between maybe some other builds. Uh, this is my skills build, for example. I built this at the very start. It's a two-piece honey year. I'll go through it. Two-piece honey years, which gives you 10% skill haste and 10% skill damage. Skill damage is what I'm looking for. Uh, skill damage, skill haste, and skill haste for the mods. You'll find all the mods are on skill haste, maxed out normally. I'm using tech support particularly on this for the, the damage increase. As you notice, these skills just hit all the time. Hence the reason I'm doing so much damage. Uh, we'll go with the chest piece, one piece wyvern. It gives you a 10% skill damage again. Again, skill high skill damage on the as the attributes and talent, uh, the mod part, sorry. Kinetic momentum is talent on that. So while both skills are out, they're just charging up all the time. Road. We'll go over here. Oh my god. Uh, they're just charging up all the time, pretty much. So it'll just give you increase, increase once those skills are out, and you just keep getting bonus damage on top of that damage you'll do after you kill somebody. Uh, we'll go to the guns because this will maybe explain a little bit more. When I'm using this, I'm looking for headshots, pretty much. It's not, it doesn't hit very hard. The object is not to hit very hard, it's to do a little bit of damage. The main shot is the spike. Headshots count 20% skill damage for 15 seconds. One hit to the head, bang. That's, you don't need to kill them, it's just a hit to the head. Agent in need of backup. Uh, it's an extra 15 seconds. On the other one, there is uh, NSYNC. When using this particular one, I get a 15% skill damage. And the damage increases while I'm using everything else as well. Skills are hitting, I'm hitting the enemy. Everything running at the same time. Increase, increase, increase. Uh, now back to the gear sets. Uh, Two-piece, uh, it's Empress International. Again, the two pieces for the skill damage. So I'm running about 30% skill damage with gear sets at the moment. Plus the extra damage I'm getting out of these two plus the extra damage I'm getting on the guns. Now, the uh, one piece uh, waveform is because this one switch, uh, oh, there you go, it tells you on the bottom, alternating current. Generates a stack of 3% skill damage, one of your skills for every second is capping at 10 stacks. After 10 seconds, the cap, will sta the cap of 10 stacks will transfer to your other skill. This keeps repeating, so one's just going to go up in like ridiculous uh, damage so to speak, then it'll wind into the other one and it'll just keep alternating the whole way through. So your experience is like little, little bit of power waves in either of them pretty much. A bit in damage increase, increase is more the point. Uh, for this particular skill of build you'll notice I'm running the rocket launcher. That's particularly for all the attributes connected with that. Uh, the EMP grenades, and when I launch my turret out, my turret isn't affected. Within a 5 meter radius or whatever else, I can put another skill into it, like you saw in the previous Coney Island mission. I can put a skill next to it, especially in the electric static stuff, and it doesn't affect it. 
that's all a combination of that, and that's how I can do it. <coughs> you may. So that's my skills. Uh, variation of actually no, that's my skills. I'll leave it at that. Because that's a different build altogether. Right, this one's my firearms build. Um, straightforward. I just built this out of building it. <coughs> the thing to note with this is that I've got bleed damage on. And this will, I'll start here actually for this build. So the Ridge Wave Pride gives me the bleeding edge shoot enemy with, uh, within 15 meters to bleed the target. You get damages pretty much for that. But the most point about this is the 15 meters you apply bleed. Now you notice I'm running wicked. So when I'm applying bleed, I'm also applying an increase now of 18% um, for 20, 20 seconds. That automatically hits as soon as I hit somebody. So pretty much, well, if I'm in 15 uh, meters of somebody, those two things activate straight away. I'm doing damage. Uh, I've got saddest on this particular weapon uh, for the 20% dealing <coughs> damage to bleeding enemies. So within, when I'm in 15 meters, I'm getting the actual bonuses out of the Ridgeway's Pride for making them, then I'm getting the status effect bonus on top of this bonus already. Stacking, stacking, stacking. Uh, usually I'd like to run out with this. The, the reason for it is it is vindictive. Vindictive says killing an enemy uh, within a status effect applies a grant to you all and uh, yeah gives you an extra crit hit chance, crit hit damage pretty much. So I like to come in with this first, as it's a team thing as well. As soon as I hit Vindictive, it's, the team gets that for 20 seconds. Come in with that first, hit the SMG with the other one, because that's my higher powered weapon. Wipe them all out. And that's the idea of that. So come in with this, hit them with the other ones, and you can see the bonus is going through. Uh, why the GS? Uh, probably for crit hit damage by the looks of that. That's all I can put that to. Everything's crit hit chance, crit hit damage. There's no health on this. No health on any of my builds. Uh, so what have we got here? We've got Hunter's Fury. So, yeah, four pieces. So enemies within 15 meters now. This works in with the chest piece, receive a debuff, amplifying your weapon damage against him by 20%. So, as you can see, by the time we've hit one person with one shot in the right place, or the second person, the second shot for the so to speak, it's already amplified by about 60 to 70 percent, and I'm doing damage. And if they're already receiving status effects, that helps so much more. So if you're running with someone with status effects, this is a good secondary to run it because it just buffs and buffs and buffs. As you can see, I can run an SMG bonus, that's my main weapon, that's what I'm running. I get 100% health on kills, so anyone I take out, 100% health and 20% armor, that's how you survive, so you're not using med kits all the time. I use a seeker mind health and med kits just to keep keep healthy. Um, and a revive hive just in case I go down <coughs> to be self sufficient. Uh, that's the basic guy, and the crossbow. I just like the crossbow, I like the um, flame, the status effect again. Uh, there is a couple of bonuses to having it, I can't remember what they are. They are for the seeker mine. They stay on a bit longer and give you a bit more health in the little bit of need. It's a little difference, but it does help a little bit. Uh, da -da -da -da. Demolitionist, okay, this is another skill build. I'm going to take you through this one and the variation, and I'll show you this one in a second. Uh, demolitionist. So you'll notice on this one, it's explosive seek mines and the hive. I probably should be using something else explosive, but these things really seem to do a lot of damage in a small space. Uh, this is just purely damage. Rocket launcher again. Same setup, pretty much well as a skills type thing. I'm still running the same two guns with the spike and end sync just to increase damage. Uh, this time I'm running a different chest piece, but skill perfectly skilled for this one. 
<coughs> skills have a 30% chance to reset, so if I take out anything, there's a 30% chance I can get a new set. Well, seeking one stage where you can keep throwing them out, three, four. I've done it up to about seven times at one stage. Does happen, got footage. Uh, and you'll notice a different sort of setup. I've still got uh, the wideband piece, which gives you damage. I'll give you the uh, press international, which gives you the two piece, gives you damage. I've gone for explosive one with the China time light in this particular version. And the reason for the 2G and S is also the, um, the explosive damage. Now you notice there's one red in this, and it's still a tier 6. That's because the rocket launcher gives me a plus 1 in skill tier, so I can afford to have some firearms in this particular build. Uh, the second lines are running at 3-2, damage, base, and uh, another one one. It's not the highest it can go, but it does enough damage. Uh, the cho the thing is, this should reset. <coughs> it hits hard. It resets. Uh, health wise, it's not great, but it's the maximum sort of build. The variation to that is this particular build. We've noticed I have changed up one of the China lights. I've taken out the China lights and put the BTSU gloves in. Uh, the BTSU's with the Hive gives it an extra cooldown and a overcharge bonus. Uh, the overcharge bonus is, as you can see, I'm running, still running the perfectly skilled on the chest. The skills have a chance to reset. If they don't have a chance to reset, I can bust the mine. I can run overcharge, which will reset all my skills anyway. Hit him again with the increased damage, which will help everybody for the short term for about 15 seconds. I'll boost everyone's skills up for about 15, 20 seconds, um, and hopefully get another two rounds in. Does work effectively. Probably works a bit more effectively than the heavy one. The difference is I lose a bit of damage. Uh, three two down to two seven. I don't think it loses too much. Uh, the hives are exactly the same anyway, so it doesn't lose out of that. Just the second ones, you lose the explosive damage. So that's a variation of that. The last one I wanted to show you was one, because I didn't realise there was a new piece in here, <coughs> the Ninja Bite Backpack, which is very Division 1. So I started messing around with builds and having a look at stuff and different ways I can do stuff, which I've got to experiment a bit more. Uh, to, to me, this is a new piece so I can build new builds. Um, because I'm sort of stuck on builds I can build. I've built the ones I like, the ones I use all the time, uh, the ones that are effective to me. This piece adds another dimension. Uh, so I'm running technically a two piece now, explosive, uh, China light. Same setup really. Uh, two piece, Empress, because that adds an extra piece to everything gear set you put onto it. Status effects and that one, which we really don't need, but it's a. Uh, three piece for the extra weapon damage oh, you can notice I've got extra uh, firepower now with this I've got extra actually I could probably reduce one of them to an extra red to get extra firepower out of them still be a six piece just thinking out loud sound like a red hat you with skill haste skill damage type thing to boost up firearms again thinking out loud uh, I lose the tech support but it's a bit more diverse in the weaponry, it's a bit more diverse if you wanted to put it into defense and whatnot, um, have some health as well, that would make your survivability a bit better. It's an interesting piece to throw around. Um, so it makes it a bit of a wild card. And the guns are hitting pretty, they're not max, but they're hitting pretty good. I think the max of that's about 82, that one's about 135. It's doing pretty good damage still. Base. That's not when it's overloaded or, or bloody maxed out. It's not bad. But I've got to use it a bit more to figure out. And it uh, seems like he's having a little bit of difficulty with this tonight. So, from me, I'm going to say good night here. I hope you had a good Sunday night. Thank you very much for joining me. I hope I um, explained the builds a little bit. I was hoping he'd jump on, but uh, he might be just having a little bit of trouble with that last part.
So I'll catch you tomorrow. I'm going to do some retro stuff tomorrow as well. Uh, you can catch that up on YouTube. They'll be exclusive to YouTube because I record them. Tomorrow night, Lollipop will be on. And you never know. You never know. I might just pop on myself. From me, have a good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are, across the world. Good night.